chairman and the CEO of UB Capital PLC, uh, which is a listed company. Uh, they've just gone through some um, reappointments, and uh, I have with me yeah. Mr. Chika Modi, who is the yeah. chairman of UB Capital PLC. Can we give a round of applause, please? We're very privileged to be here. Uh, we have a very special interest in the council markets. Not just as a good economy, we are the only full service investment bank that is listed, but also because we make a living in the council markets. So we live by example, we can have ourselves supported and we can encourage people um, to get listed from the market as well. Um, we're very excited about what's going on in the country as a whole, and the sort of changes that are going to a sort of change as well. Um, it matters. There's far more ordinary, there's more confidence, and you guys can, you're leading with us that um, also have the progress of that, are bringing sensible way to the markets. And we're happy that it's been sustained. That has encouraged us um, to invest aggressively in this market. We believe in that. And as, we, as my colleague was saying, we have plans to go a little deeper and wider. So thank you for having us. In terms of our initiatives towards achieving market leadership, um, we would like to say that these initiatives include internal processes and also include the acquisition of um, what we call a league of experts across all our spheres of operation. It also includes um, initiatives like new system, a new um, IT system that we're deploying that will be web fully web enabled and accessible to our clients and it will enable our clients to enjoy end-to-end -end services across all our four areas of business. It also includes um, more visibility that we would create you know, as time goes on. Um, if I can um, share a little more, we, we have um, four lines of business, four principal lines of business, which is investment banking, trusteeship, asset management, and stockbroking. Um, each of these businesses is manned by clear, acknowledged experts. We think that's one of the things that would strengthen our ability to deliver value to our stakeholders. Um, in addition, we are repositioning ourselves such that we can deliver services to our clients as one integrated financial services group and that means that um, it gives greater ease of doing business from one part of the business to the other so if for example your entry point you know, in, at some stage was trusteeship the same um, documentation and information will suffice you know for you to be able to you know, do business with us across all the spheres. You will be managed as a client from one single point in terms of customer services, in terms of um, reporting, in terms of um, account opening, documentation, in terms of external relations. Uh, now, we're able to do this through the group shared services that we're deploying. Um, this is underpinned by a state-of-the-art system that we have um, developed largely in-house based on working on of course some on a very good and strong base system um, our initiatives also include like I said positioning ourselves it includes also expanding our activities even beyond the shores of Nigeria into West Africa and gradually across Africa. But for this year, our focus will still be significantly on this market because we think that there is room to create value. Um, in terms of um, making ourselves, strengthening our capabilities as experts in each area in which we operate, we are going to see more of that, more of capacity development, both for ourselves and even for our clients as well.